In this equation, we have copper 2 carbonate plus nitric acid. So to balance it, let's count the atoms up on each side of the equation. We have one copper, one carbon, three oxygens, plus be careful here, there's three more here. Three plus three, that gives us six of those oxygen atoms, one hydrogen and one nitrogen. On the product side, we have one copper, one carbon, and then oxygens. Two times three is six, plus two, seven, eight, plus one, nine. So we have a total of nine oxygen atoms on the product side. We have two hydrogens, and then for nitrogen, we have two. This two applies to everything in parentheses. Two times the one, we have two nitrogen atoms. It looks like, let's leave the oxygens till last. That's a good strategy. Let's balance the nitrogens. We have two here and one here. If we put a two in front of the HNO3, we have one times two. That gives us two hydrogens, one times two. So the nitrogens are balanced, the hydrogens are balanced, and let's update the oxygen atoms. We have our three here, plus two times three is six. So three plus six, that equals nine. So the oxygens are balanced, and we're done. This equation is balanced. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for CuCO3 plus HNO3. Thanks for watching.